Skywriting became a popular way to advertise for the next several decades, except for during World War II. Skywriting is not new. In fact, it goes back to the early years of aviation. It's credited to the Royal Air Force Major John Clifford Savage. In 1910, he came up with its techniques and had a successful skywriting fleet in England. Savage flew throughout the 1920s and 1930s, bringing the practice to America. The first big advertising of skywriting extravaganza was in 1922 at Derby Day, a popular horse race in England. During the event, a pilot named Cyril Turner wrote Daily Mail over the crowds. A few months later, after shipping his plane to the United States, he wrote Hello USA over Manhattan. The next day, he came back and wrote in the sky the telephone number of the hotel where he was staying. It was rumored, but never proven, that after the stunt, the hotel's phone rang continuously for three hours. Skywriting became a popular way to advertise for the next several decades, except for during World War II, when planes were in high demand for military purposes. In fact, skywriting became one of the preferred ways of advertising because of its ability to reach large numbers of people at big events. Let us know what your favorite part of this video was in the comments section. And if you enjoyed it, be sure to give it a like and a share. Also, you can follow STEM and 30 on Facebook and Twitter, and be sure to subscribe to the National Air and Space Museum's YouTube channel.